I feel quite safe saying to the general community that once again, the risk of monkeypox is very small for the general population. Cases of monkeypox are on the rise in the United States and here in Arizona. Last week, the Biden administration declared it a public health emergency, which allocated even more vaccines to states. News for Tucson, Shelley Jackson joins us from the south side with what the health department is doing to combat this virus. Shelley. Well, Sean, Arizona has the 14th highest caseload in the U.S. with 100 cases in the state, six right here in Pima County and Tucson, like many other cities, the vaccine supply is limited. I stood in line for, you know, about an hour and a half or so, which is not long uh, compared to what I heard from other folks in other areas of the country. Hundreds of Tucsonans lined up Saturday to get the monkeypox vaccine. Nearly 400 were vaccinated. Pima County will have received 1,500 vaccines by the end of this month and expects another 1,500 this fall. The supply is inadequate for what we are seeing, not only with the number of cases, but the subsequent risk for individuals that are self-identifying based on behavior and exposure that they need to be vaccinated. Cullen says the supply is low because people just didn't expect the virus to take off like it did. The U.S. is also importing the vaccine from Europe, and that is taking time. The at-risk population includes healthcare workers, people recently exposed to the virus, and people who have multiple male sex partners. The vaccine is given in a two-dose series, 28 days apart. Cullen says the first dose is thought to be 85 to 90 percent effective. Pima County is thinking, meaning me, is thinking closely about following that scenario, that we will give one vaccine. When we get more supply, then we will schedule people for the second shot. Now, the health department is teaming up Wednesday night with TMC to hold a monkey pops monkeypox, excuse me, webinar where the public can ask any questions of doctors. That link is on our website, kvoa.com. Live from the South Side, Shelly Jackson, News 4, Tucson.